Come on up, Kevin. Go, Kevin. to be here at this brewery. I'm always really excited to talk about things that involve yeast or creamy heads. But enough about the presidential nominees. It's no shock that booze and dating go together, but I personally have a very specific rule I follow with that. I always make sure that I drink and I drink beer and then I liquor. We're off to a good start today. You know, everybody drinks and ends up getting beer goggles. But in the Bay Area, it's special. We drink and get beer Googles. You know, people like all kinds of different beer. It's very subjective. For example, I like IPA, but R. Kelly likes IP in your A. You know, there's a lot of great songs that are about beer. There's thousands of them, but my personal favorite one is I whip my hair back and forth. I whip my hair back and forth. This guy knows what I'm talking about. What? Alright, so what is the deal uh, with alcohol free beer? I mean, that's almost like having sex, but instead of an orgasm, you just end up with warts. I mean, it's just, oh, 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 jewels. No. So, anybody here on a date? Anybody here on a date? What's that like? Good? I mean, the last one that I was on involved in being wrapped in bacon and being stuffed with goat cheese. A lot of people don't know this, but the Catholic Church has a patron saint of beer. Priests picked this over 900 years ago, and it caused a bunch of controversy back then, but the good news is, is that Catholic priests have never had any controversy since. <laughs> and we got it. Oh man. So, there's a lot of beers out there that are named after women. Amber, Stella, St. Pauli's Girl. And I think the reason is that no one wants to drink a beer named after a guy. I mean, can you imagine some dude reaching into a cooler and grabbing a Marcus? <laughs> it's like, Yo, bro, can you, uh, can you pass me a Marcus real quick? Nah, man, but I do have some nice Richard on tap. <laughs> and you know, speaking of cakes, speaking of cakes, what is the big deal about that? Because, I mean, if I wanted to hang out with anybody who was overweight, cold, and frigid, I would just marry my ex. <laughs> You know, speaking of my ex, we broke up because I, there was just a lot of drama. For example, she hated the fact that I drank too much, and I wasn't a fan of the fact that she didn't shave her Anheuser-Busch. <laughs> a lot of people my age talk about the effect that beer goggles has on them, but I don't really see an effect, because no matter how much I drink, women look the same to me. Embarrassed, sad, and just want to walk away. <laughs> so, have you guys ever tried to get a little person drunk? It is pretty amazing because they hop around and everything on just like a thimble of beer, and it's like looking at little gays hanging out in their own little pride parade. The only thing that's better is getting a two-year-old drunk. Now you may be saying to yourself, useless weirdo, how could you talk about something like that? But, have you ever tried it? Did I? That's a good question. Have you tried it, Dead Eyes? No. It's pretty easy. <laughs> that was weird. So, on a related note, how come so many beer
beer commercials feature animals in them, but when I tried to feed um, a six pack to a rescue kitten, I looked at like a jerk. It's just horrible dub uh, double standards. <laughs> I also think commercials that involve drunk driving are a little yeah. weird to me because they're always talking about finding a DD. But you know what else begins with DD? Drunk driver. I personally think it's not a good idea for us to think about insanely complicated acronyms when I'm drunk. IDTS. I don't think so. <laughs> See, you guys have clearly had too many. Yeah, that's it. Anyway, you guys have been a great crowd, and just as a reminder, the greatest cure for a hangover is listening to Kevin Klein live on Live 105. <laughs> but in all seriousness, when I drink, I get hungover. When black men drink, they get well hungover. Asians get chung over. Astronauts get tang over. Women get hangoveries. Old people get hang over the hill. And best of all, this set is over. over.